Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. It has been a minute. I got married and I know where's the wedding video. Don't worry, it's coming. I am not in charge of editing the video. I feel like that would take away some of the magic for me. So I think we have to wait just like a little bit longer, but I promise you, I will show you guys when I have it. I'm gonna start today's look a little bit differently. I'm gonna start with a mask and then I'm gonna try to do my eyes as the mask dries just because this mask is so on point. It's brand new and I honestly just can't wait to try it. It is the new Glam Glow Glitter Mask. So, hello. This is perfect for the glitter look. Oh, the box even smells good. Glam Glow, you just do it so well. Ooh! I don't want it to fall on the ground, but yep, I want that on my face. Here we go. Yes, so good. All right, goal here. Put this all on really quickly and then set a timer while it dries. Do the eyes. I'm gonna keep the mask on for, let's do 40 minutes. And I have a timer set. Look at those fingerprints on my phone. I'm gonna throw on some of this, I think it's called Erin, Arin, And it's a rose lip conditioner. I love this stuff. Oh, camera, why you play me like that? Hello? Okay, we're back. Prime my eyes with the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. Pretty much whatever look I do, I take the bronzer I'm gonna use that day and throw it in my crease as kind of like a transition color. I just think it looks the best, it's the easiest, and multi-purpose product right here. You're gonna bronze my face and transition my eyes. For my base color, I'm going to use both of the Lime Crime Venus One and Two palettes because they have some beautiful, like super warm, orangey, perfect transition, buildable colors. So pretty much we're going with like a very warm, to red orange eye. It's gonna be a lot of layering. So I'm going in first with Divine from the original Venus palette from Lime Crime and putting that just where we put the bronzer and kind of lightly taking this all over my eye to kind of set the base. Next using Creation, which is like a very like orangey warm brown. I'm going to just push this all over my lid. Oh my god, I think my camera wasn't recording when I put the glitter on my eyes for this glitter look. If that's the case, what I used and the best thing to apply glitter is Lit Cosmetics Glitter Base. And I don't know if they have different shades. This is just the Clearly Liquid Glitter Base. This is the big size guy. He is amazing. He dries really quickly and your glitter won't fall off. I also used it it or lit lit cosmetics uh glitter i use the shade abba and it looks pink but it reflects green it's really cool i'm going to hit this with a little bit of liner i'm going to use the kat von d tattoo liner and when i apply the glitter i ignore right by my lash line because i hate putting liquid liner on top of glitter it just you have to have so much finesse and it never really looks good it kind of looks like you have sand on your eyes Oh, this liner is just out of commission. What a sad day. Come on, we got one more left in us. And curl. And curl. And curl. And then, oh, pfft. I almost just ripped out my eyelashes while dancing. <laughs> For lashes, I am using the Black Magic Lash in Fetish. Reusing them because that's what you should do with your lashes. Don't waste them. A little bit of mascara. It's time. It's time. All right, gonna start peeling at the bottom. Do you hear that noise? <gasps> There's my face. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Success. Take a look at my skin up close. It feels nice and firm and clean, but I need to hit it with some moisturizer because I'm just a dry person in general. And I'm going to use this because it has a bit of glitter in it. It is the Glam Glow Nude Glow. 
and I'm gonna put that all over my face. For brows, I'm going to use the Benefit Brow Conditioner. I think this gives the soap brow look without actually having to like do the whole thing with a bar of soap. I just do two little squeezes up and then I will comb this through before I do my brows. And I will just do like little strokes where I'm missing hair. There you go, a pretty easy natural brow. You don't have to go like super crazy with filling it in. Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. This one's really good if you're gonna have a super long night like New Year's. The best foundation I've ever found and I've tried a lot. NARS Sheer Glow. It's just so beautiful and it's beautiful on everyone, especially if you like something that's more glowy, dewy, if you have dry skin. If you have super oily skin and you like something like super matte, you probably won't like this, but other than that, this is the best foundation. Next, a little bit of Urban Decay Naked Concealer under the eyes, and I like to put this around my nose because I get really red. Down forehead Chin. please do not judge my Anastasia cream contour palette it's dirty I'm just going to use the lightest colors like right under my cheekbone with the contour shades I'm just going to lightly contour I don't want like a crazy chiseled look next you guessed it we have to bake the under eyes a little bit of contour with my Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. For blush, I'm actually using a highlighter. It is by Becca, and it is the new Smoky Quartz. I have never used it before, but I feel like it would be really pretty as a blush, especially on top of this like super warm bronzer. For highlight, also new from Becca, this is Golden Mint. And it's just like, it looks like it would be mint in the thing. I've used this. And it does have a little bit of that green, so I think it'll be really pretty with the ABBA glitter. But for the most part, it looks just like the perfect highlight. For the lip, I'm going to mix two. First, NARS Liquid Lip in Done It Again. On top, I think I'm just going to do the center with the Lime Crime Diamond Crushers in Summer. Back to the eyes with the Bright Orange or Rust color jam from the Venus palette. I'm just gonna blend this messily underneath my eyes. Time to take my hair out of these pins. Yes. And we are done. Here's my finished New Year's glitter sparkle everywhere makeup look. I hope that you guys liked it. If you have any questions, leave it in the comments down below. If you want to check out anything I talked about in this video or follow me on Instagram or something like that, that will be in the video description. Wedding video coming soon. I love you guys and I will see you in the next one. Bye! To keep my hands on myself Think I'll dust them off, put them back